Hello everyone, it's Kent Jackson from Uniques and Antiques. I'm going to do the walkthrough for our July 7th, 2018 local estates auction. This auction is for the small section of the auction, which begins at 10 a.m. So I'll walk up and down the tables and you'll see what we have. This is an auction that is uh, mostly uh, items we cleaned out of houses in the main line, Philadelphia, uh, some from Allentown. Uh, these right here were from yeah, main line, Berwyn area. Uh, Villanova, I think one was from uh, Bluebell. So a bunch of estates, a bunch of items. The furniture over here, I've already done a separate video for. That begins at 11. The smalls begin at 10. And uh, we walk up and down the tables and we sell what's on them. Start us at at least five bucks and we'll group it up. So you can see a nice lot of smalls, carvings, good enamel, you have trains. There's a, if you uh, continue watching, you're gonna see uh, maybe three different lots of different trains on the tables here. Lots of china and orientalia, silver overlay. Just walk up and down the aisles, just give you an idea of the scale that's here. Once we, um, once we finish that section, we'll come over here and do the costume jewelry showcases. Now I've taken pictures of these, so I'm not gonna spend a lot of time looking at every single case. But you have some coins, you have some beads, you have some rhinestones, more coins over there. You have uh, pins, bringing us to a big collection of record albums. Luggage, I'm not really gonna go into the record albums. You can come by and take a look, see what we have by the box. Uh, Delft, you have uh, a lot of Judaica, some Liadro figures right here. There's a veterinarian, a little ping pong player, and uh, a little girl poking her eye out. Silver plate, there's some sterling, silver overlay. You have the uh, Royal Dalton Toby mugs, some more silver plate. Look at this pair of very nice marble-based candle holders. Jumping over this direction, more china. You have China, you have the bird plates right here. These bird plates are by, who are they by? Uh, Meekin. More China. Here's the second lot of trains that I was talking about, the Lionel. You have the double-sided uh, train right there. You have the a couple uh, operating cars. I think this one's the milk car. And then you have the tank car. Some good higher-end Lionel trains. Here's some of the, uh, the operating parts of that. You have a good old sewing machine. Look at this great lamp right here. That's very nice. Again, no catalog for this auction, so none of these are items are online for online bidding. However, you can come by. You can leave absentee bids. We'll take your phone bid if you're willing to start the item at at least 300. Here's a nice set of Wedgwood right here. These are um, Susie Cooper, and it is Black Keystone. Moving on, that's a Picasso uh, estate vase, silver plate. I thought this was an amazing box right here. Look at this thing. Open it up. Oh, what could you put in there? It's kind of empty now, but it's fitted for all your, all your fitted box needs. A very nice uh, Epern here. Just need to repair that one piece of glass, but it's a super nice one if you need the parts for it. These are very unusual, the um, Copeland. Nice little set right there. Moving down, here's another nice china set. This one is Mikasa, and it is Nature's Garden. Moving on, let me jump this direction. Got some masks, more stuff. Got a whole shelf full of glass Yadro figures bunch of Yadros, etc. All right, that's area five. We kind of sell in order. Let me try to find area, area six. I guess it's this direction. Then we have all these, what does that say? Area seven. So area six is around here somewhere. I'm not sure. We have all this uh, kind of wardrobe clothes out of a nice estate in New York City. You have good Brooks Brothers suits. You have great coats by Orvis. You have fur coats. You have um, great shirts, Tommy Bahama shirts. You know what they're worth, Joseph A. Bank. More and more, Brooks Brothers, Patagonia. More Brooks Brothers, so a lot of good clothing. We sell clothing one at a time, then we sell the rest of the rack. All right, let's jump back in the, in the row right here. You have cut glass, you have china sets, 
You have nice sewing machine, nice uh, little groupings right here. This is all scarfs, whole box, whole box full of scarves. Jumping around this direction, again from a from a house liquidation that we did. Everything from glassware to craft supplies to electronics, old teapot collection right there. Very cool collectible teapots. Um, purses, you have everything from the vintage plastic purses to the uh, coach style ones and the Louis Vuitton. Little clutch right there, JNY. So lots of good purses. Here is Lionel train set number three. There's a nice little box of more modern set, but here's a little bit older section right here. You have the good passenger cars in the back. You have the other cars, operating cars, etc. This one's the explosives car. You know what happens to that one? It just hits the right part on the track and it blows up. That's a fun car. All right, so then we have this way. You have the snorkel. You have the uh, bull and bear um, bookends, but you could also... Put them with these bull and bear bookends and maybe have two bulls and two bears or two bears and two bulls. Or uh, you can make them fight each other like Wall Street. Here's a nice set of, um, well, not a set, but partial Lennox Black Noble. Make that Black Royal, Royale. Little build of scout stuff. You have some Dremels. This way, look at the nice binoculars, the Honus waterproof. Um, reticule illuminated binoculars all right coming down to the home stretch some good horns or antlers lots of tools electronics again kind of pottery art let me turn around and do the rest of the art wall here so as you can see everything from uh, stained glass to posters to clown pictures to prints Lots of good originals. I mean, I'm going to walk by these pretty quickly and then I'm going to walk backwards so we can see them. So we can see them from further away. All right, so you have a Curtis Jair up top there, McKnight, it looks like, a Paris poster. There's like an 80s lacquer little triptych right there. You have an oil painting. It looks like it says by Gilt right there. The woman and the lady it looks like an Edna Hibble. Um, nice little gilt mirror with a great frame. Uh, there's block prints. There's some very cool, like, 60s style uh, prints and florals, etc. We have more art that's all the way over in the other section. But as I walk over to that section, I will start ending this video. All right, so thanks for watching. We are here on Monday, the 9th of July. We are not here the rest of this week. This week is the 4th, 5th, and 6th of July, 7th, 8th. We're not here. We'll be back on the 9th for preview at uh, noon. So here's the rest of the art. You have some art on the walls right there. Very cool. And a very colorful oil painting, etc. All right, so subscribe to our channel so you know when we have another video coming in. Uh, subscribe to our mailing list. Follow us on Twitter and Instagram. Instagram's fun. If you uh, watched us last Tuesday, we went through New York City and our Instagram story was, you know, a picture of almost every stop we made. We made 25 or so stops and you could have seen some New York City sites, you know, vicariously through the eyes of our delivery team. All right, this has been Ken Jackson from Uniques and Antiques. Thanks for watching. We'll see you at the auction. Bye-bye.